Hello everyone! Today another short video about test run of yet another wrong fuel separator so running the mix of diesel and uh, petrol here and pumping it through the machine Here we've got a diesel coming out continuously and here's a petrol. So this machine actually removes all the coloring from the petrol and leaves it in the diesel so it doesn't affect uh, the engine of the digital car anyhow at all I'm driving my car I don't know two and a half years non-stop I don't know how much it costs at the petrol station and I also using this kind of fuel both of my cars are turbocharged petrol and diesel ones uh, and petrol one is uh, uh, electronic injection as well I've got two European cars so not a problem at all and this one is for turbo diesel not a problem at all no smoke no nothing no issues with the engine because this is the same very same fuel from the petrol station but it's been mixed accidentally all I'm doing just separating it from each other and it's ready for use again uh, here's an actual separator, distiller. It's a small one. This particular one is uh, 1.5 kilowatts, 220 volts, and uh, production rate is about 10, from 10 to 15 liters of mix per hour. Currently running at 148, it's just climbing a bit, only started. I'm gonna keep it at temperatures between 150 and uh, 180, just enough for the petrol separation. And this is actually the temperature of the vapor within the reactor. The temperature of boiling is much higher, so it's just enough for for the petrol to be separated, evaporated, and uh, diesel to be removed. It's all solid construction. There's a big flange, bolts, nuts. Everything made out of stainless steel. Everything's running. There's a pump. You can hear it's pumping, running as well. This is it, thank you.